Once again, the Cobalt Quiet Tech air compressor has started to become really loud. So I'm gonna take off the heads and clean in there and see if that improves it. This is what the piston cups look like and why it was making so much noise is because the air was leaking out the side because this piston cup is torn. It just got really thin in some places, especially since these, these pistons kind of rock back and forth inside of the cylinder. They wear more in certain places than others. Like they seem actually pretty worn on the side. This one wore prematurely here. This one over here is still okay, but it has some thin areas too. So this is after about six months of use. It has a three year warranty. And this compressor turns on about two to three times an hour to start to start compressing again during the workday. We try to turn it off at night, but we don't always remember. So sometimes it, it cycles at night too. Sometimes it runs a little bit longer duty cycles if we're using a lot of air, but nothing extreme, I would say. I don't mind replacing these piston seals. It's not difficult to take apart. It's uh, not difficult to replace them. But the problem is when I called Cobalt and who is associated with Lowe's, they said that they don't provide that as a replacement parts or a kit. They don't even have the motor as a replacement part. So their best suggestion was to return the compressor. And I've already done it once because it had the same exact issue and the same symptoms. And it doesn't make sense to just keep returning compressors and getting new compressors when this is actually a very easy fix. So I'm gonna to try to find a replacement piston cup material that fits inside a 70 millimeter cylinder the wear from the cup material is all visible on here. So another thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try to add air filtration to the end of this where this fan is sucking air in to try to keep the air that comes on the bottom side of the piston as clean as possible and reduce wear there. Of course you have these air filters coming in on the intake, but some air filters on the bottom wouldn't hurt too because the bottom is open. So I'm not going to plan to buy another Cobalt brand Quiet Tech air compressor again because Cobalt is not going to be able to supply the parts that I need to repair this air compressor. And their response is to go and return it within the warranty period. So it's got a three year warranty just to return it. And okay, that's fine, but then you're trashing this compressor basically. And also, it's a pain in the butt to carry this big heavy thing to the store and buy a new one in a waste of time. It takes me far less time to just take the head off with eight screws and remove these two screws and replace this cup. So I'm going to try to find some cups and report back on that. What I'm worried about is what happens when the cylinder wears out. Am I going to be able to find a replacement cylinder? This seems like a pretty generic air compressor motor, so I suspect that I should be able to find some 70 millimeter cylinders that fit this.